What, tell me about what your favorite things are. Let's start with your favorite musician. All right, favorite musician, forever and always Led Zeppelin. I, I really, really like them. The, I like their influence with a bit of blues that I have, like You're rock. You're listening to them now? Yes. Okay, yes. so let's talk about your favorite Led Zepp album and track, if there was one track, which is very difficult. Well, An I, album. Let's start with album well, first. Well, let's say that their first album, Led Zeppelin, mm -hmm. I really liked because there you can really feel the influence, like um, from the blue, the blues. Yes, absolutely. So we have "You Shook Me," which is like uh -huh. that. I really like that one. Then, um, uh, "Babe, I'm Gonna Leave You." Actually, the, I like. Oh, I love from, that one. Yeah, the thing is, I really like a lot of songs, but mm. like really like them. So since it's hard I've been to loving you, I like. Also, that I've been that's a great. Oh, Jesus, his voice on that is ridiculous, isn't it? Yes. So how did also, you come to to know about mm, Led Zeppelin? I think um, I've been listening a bit to my father, like to some songs, but like that was really, playing in the background when you were growing up. Yes, yes, but I think like really like I listened there, but it was then a big break, the break when I was little and I was listening to Eminem and other things. And then I start uh, on YouTube, like discovering on YouTube music. I was like, I like this brand. I like. I discovered the Doors, mm. and then I was trying to find like similar things. That's why now it's better this this app that is called Deezer, and you you put a you put an artist, and then you put artist mix, and then it brings you like to kind of like similar artists, and that's where you can discover discover more music. So how do you spell that Deezer? Uh, like uh, Geezer? D D E E E E. -E. Z -E -R. Z E R. Yes, Deezer. It's a good app. I recommend it to. So, like what's the famous? Them. Isn't Spotify like that? Spotify, I think, is the same. Yeah, but, uh, but um, I just I why my Deezer? friend my friend oh, told okay. me. Yeah, my is friend told me about it. So cool. I just started. That's a good tip. Yeah. Okay, so your dad influence and then a you, little you, bit, you, yeah. just a little bit, yeah. Okay. Um, so the favorite song, but of all time, is one. Of, it would be a Led Zeppelin song. Who do you listen to now? Uh, no, now I listen also to Led Zeppelin, to Arctic Monkeys. Actually, Arctic Monkeys? Yeah, I like them. That's so funny. Yeah, but uh, Franz Ferdinand. But oh, it wow. also depends on my mood. Like, and if I go running, I listen to electronic music. Do you really? Yeah, I mean, I know also DJs. I like. Oh, wow. I know Solomon. <laughs> I mean, I'm like very like... Eclectic. Yeah, and then Eminem. I have the Eminem side with like rappers. When you were training, doing your running in your youth, what would you listen to? Eminem um, and rap? We didn't listen so much when we were training, but ah. before competitions and while we were listening just when we run uh, at the beginning, we do the yeah, tra uh, tra to warm, up. warm up. And I would, back then I was listening a lot to Eminem. Right. I mean, I still would love to go to his concert and everything. It's just that I, so I now I listen just to some songs. Okay. And I was listening to Eminem or to Evanescence. And actually, I actually Evanescence. I went, yeah, Evanescence. I was at their concert like uh, a couple of weeks ago, just to, to remember the old times. But I still like them at the concert. I was like, oh my god, yes! Great, <laughs> but now that's I don't fantastic. So we've got a uh, yeah flavor yeah. of all of yeah. your multiple tastes. Depends on the mood and on the day. Yes. On what I'm doing. Favorite movie. Again, <sighs> one you've seen recently, and then maybe of all time that bears repeat well, viewing. Well, uh, recently. I know it's a bit late, but recently I just saw Elizabeth I with Kate Blanchett. An amazing film for her. Very good. That's a good, yeah. that's a strong start for Kate. Yeah, exactly. Do you like very her? Very good. I like, I, very, I like that film, but favorite all-time movie, it's Seven. Wow, okay. Oh, Fincher. God, Fincher's movie. breakout film. I didn't, yeah. I you mean, like thrillers? Yes, and uh, like like Clockwork Orange. You do. And that, that that's the movies I like more, like as in type of movie. When I look for like acting, I like big range of movies, but like for like how I feel, like Seven was amazing. And the, the, and then you know actually that Kevin Spacey. Also, oh. I didn't know because I didn't do research before seeing the movie. Actually, my mentor T B Clan she told me before my favorite was Fight Club, and he told me um, you're gonna like Seven more. Mm. And did I, you? Yeah, I yes. did. <laughs> and then he told me, um, he didn't, I didn't do any research. I said, okay, TB told me to watch it, I'm going to go watch it. And then I saw it, in the end it was Kevin Spacey, okay. which is one of my favorites. And I, I didn't know that it was him. And it was like such a boom. And then when I was reading about the movie, movie, because mm. usually I see the movie and after I read about the movie, I read that it's true that in his name is not even on the um, 
on the thing for the movie, how they say the commercial, wow, because he asked for it. And uh, they were not happy, the directors and the producers. He wanted but he his said name he taken want, off the credits. Yeah, so, so, so it's, no, he not taken, not in a bad way, so it becomes uh, like mysterious. Mis oh, and so he not said, not to ruin I, it, because he, he thought he'd be the bad guy, everyone yeah, would know. Yeah, everybody would know, yes. yeah, exactly. That's Kaiser so awesome, Soza, yes. that's uh, so awesome, because I got the exact impact, even though I saw the movie later, I got the exact impact. <laughs> Good old Kevin. Does he then qualify as your favorite actor? Yes, him and uh, and Leonardo DiCaprio, as in, in guys. As and in, girls? Well, Kira Knightley and. Uh, Kira Knightley, Knightley yes, yes, and Natalie no. Portman. Oh, yes. I can see that yeah. mirroring, the narcissistic mirroring of those two girls. Yes, <laughs> those are the ones you look most like. Um, but not Penelope Cruz. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> not the Spanish ones. Let's leave the Spanish out of it. But Kira's wicked, isn't she? Yeah, it's awesome. Like, um, and also that movie with uh, with Freud. Well, I don't remember exactly the name of movie, but I like the role she did that. What well, about? Um, uh, no, I mean I like a lot, a lot of them. Uh, a lot of them. What about the? Many three like. Uh, what about the French Anne actress Hathaway. who played Lady uh, Macbeth? Uh, oh. In Macbeth. Have you seen Macbeth? Uh, no, I didn't. Oh, you the, have to the go. recent one, yes, right? Yes, yes, no, you have I to watch it. It's it. so incredibly it's beautifully I was shot. Really scared. Like, yeah, I was like, Marion Cotillard. Yeah, I didn't see it. I was like, You're not a Cotillard fan? No, I wasn't. I wasn't. A, I don't know. I didn't want to see it like being made. Na I don't know. I just I skipped it. Let's say I skipped the movie. You should see it. Just you I should will. See I will. I know. I should. I should. Due, I should, due, I should, due diligence. Yeah. Uh, Katia, she was great as Chanel as well. I remember really liking that film. Mm, I didn't see it. You didn't see it. On the list. Put, Put it, it on the list. It's Netflix it. tonight. Yeah. Okay. Um, so who were we saying the favorite actresses? It was. Uh, actresses. Kira Knightley, and there was a second. Natalie, Natalie Portman. Natalie Portman. Yeah, you know Black Swan. I can resonate so much with it to yes. some levels, like yes. so much. That's when I started liking her after I saw that one. Although I thought Jackie was a bit of a joke, I, I didn't buy it any. I didn't buy any of it at any point in any way. Everything about the choices to me was self-conscious and wrong, and I thought her over overdoing it. It ruined it for me. You liked it. Yeah, I did. I don't Jesus. know. Jesus. <laughs> I, th I was embarrassed. I literally was embarrassed for all <laughs> involved. She, it was well received. I think it was up for all sorts of awards. What yeah. do I know? But yeah. I couldn't, I hated it. Um, uh, favorite television show? Do you watch television at all? Um, yes. I recently started watching because um, I, I try normally, I still have a big loop of movies that I have to watch. Mm. But I watched and I love Peaky Blinders. Peaky Blinders. Yeah! And they're Ki still going until the fourth Killian the Murphy's stage. great. Yeah, yeah. That English is. model, why did she do have her nose job? Who? You know his love interest in the first, the first uh, season. Se Grace? season. Yeah. Yes, Grace. Yeah. She had a lovely nose like mine. She had an aquiline yeah, and bump. A, yeah, and she's had a no and yes, by by uh, series three, I think she has had a nose job. I, she's I didn't, completely I, different. Well, I, re I didn't. I just realized that okay, it's everything different because they're then living yes. together. And I liked so much. No, no spoilers. Have but, a look at it again. But like, I will look at it. But I liked what happened to her. I was yeah. also shocked. I like TV series that like really shock me because it's hard to really be shocked these days by new things. It's kind of like you kind of know what's happening. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And the crazy Russian. Spy uh, one yeah, was good. Yeah, 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 exactly. That's great. Okay, um, Killian Murphy is amazing. A lot of those. I really like him as actor, and also the the um, the woman plays Polly. I forgot her name now. I don't yes, really remember yes, her name. Yes. She's very good. I like her so it's much. It's a great. Acting. It's a great show. Yeah, and it is. And is it coming back? Well, it's it's coming. A fourth is coming now at the end of 2017, and okay. they announced they're gonna make fifth as well. Why aren't you in Game of Thrones? As one of the Dornish, I Dornish I girls. I haven't seen it yet. You've not freaking seen no, Game of Thrones? No, no, I'm, I'm backwards. That's I didn't so see it. That's so good because it has such an international No, I cast. saw like three TV series. Like first You could have been in the Dornish would... one. It's shot in Malta. It's all people like you. Oh. <laughs> You're look. Yeah, no, I mean, seriously. I, can, I know, I can, I'm I not have, I know what it's about. I know I can totally prove it. Like, you know you have to. It's a must. You literally have to go home. And, and start watching Game freaking of Game of Thrones today because <laughs> yes. you've got like, no. a lot to catch up with yeah, and you will be things. you'll really be inspired and you'll really be excited by all of those Dornish characters that look exactly like you yeah I have to watch it there's I a spin-off series 
So you can manifest a role on the next one. There's going to be a prequel spin-off. What's a spin-off? Exactly? Is when they do another series oh, cashing right. in on the success of the first. So there will be roles for you. Oh. So oh, watch this oh one. God. Get yeah. excited and inspiring because I'm not I mean, I'm, I'm sure. not, jo that's a, I'm not that's joking. Thing. I'm so sure I'm going to no, be so excited. You're going home and watching Game of Thrones. All right, I will. Okay, no, no, I'm not joking. Yes, okay, I will. And I'm going to follow up and I make sure you're doing exactly. it. Exactly. Okay. Um <laughs> Because I'm, I've been thinking to do it. Because a lot of a lot of people through who I look up for advice is when watching TV series, they told me about Game of Thrones, and I was like, okay, I have to watch oh, it. God, there's action! But I I'm can scared, see. Scared, but I'm scared. I'm gonna be like, oh, you I will love be it. scared. I'm you just will. gonna but wanna watch non-stop. That's, and what, like, that's what's gonna give you the that's, fire that's up your what, ass to get yeah, out and then, there and do it. You need it. And then I watched another TV series that got me so shocked. First, I watched it because I thought it's gonna be something easy. I do massage like one hour with like these machines. So I said, ah, oh. oh, I need to watch something easy. Oh, teenagers, and it's called Skins. Oh, Do you know good. Skins? That's a TV show, an English one. Yeah, yes. About teenagers. Teenagers, but like and all it was the shocking. problems. Whoa, my God! Was like, it great? You, you saw it? Do you know about no. it? No. I think so that we did it. They did, an, episode, they did an American version as well. Uh, yeah, I think so too. Because some some things are very general and like boring, but there are some. I never. I was one thing happened there that I was so shocked. I was watching it in in the bus. That was. I was like this, like you don't, you don't imagine. I was shocked like two weeks after. I was still shocked. It was because it had like great. good, very good turnouts. That's the thing, like huge turnouts that you don't expect at all. Good. Yeah, I don't want to give spoilers, now, but I'm wow. inspired by that. Now. But you need to be patient because then also first season, like it starts like very like. It takes time. Sometimes yeah. it takes to build character. Yeah. Okay, let's get into the uh, fashiony stuff. So the f your favorite model? Did I ask the like, girl that like, yesterday? Who's your favorite model? I don't um, think I did. I missed that. Well, I like to get inspired by a lot of them, but Isabel Goulart will be like a Goulart. body. Yeah, Goulart. She has the best. I don't know if somebody would ask me to do you like her body. body. You like her perfect body. Perfect body. Yes, yeah, exactly. She was. But she's right. insane. She trains insane, like in a Does good she? way. In a good way. Yeah, and you watch her Instagram but stories. But you're a and flipping everything. athlete. Like, yeah, I'm. I'm turning insane too. But I. I I, uh, uh, I like yeah. my fellows. Cool. <laughs> like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, girl. Yes. Go, girl. Go, girl. Go, okay. Girl. Favorite designer we know. Yeah, Jean Paul Gaultier or Armani. Yep. Cannot make a decision. Okay, here we go with the accessories, shoes, bags, sunglasses, all the little bits okay, and Okay, uh, shoes, shoes. I love Oxford shoes. No, Oxford? it's too hard for them. Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. yeah as, as, a, as a, the style. The style, yeah. And uh, as in brand, I use, I go, there's a, a shop in Paris called Cliff that I like. Okay. Or again, Nero Giardini, the Italian brand. I just look for very good quality Oxfords because I like to have like two pairs, three pairs. Good. Yeah, my you father hates me. He's like, you look that they're the same. I'm like, no, not exactly the same. That's There's this great. You should go to you business. should go to Piccadilly and get shod of the English. The you real should, one. The I should real go. I should go to London. Bespoke. So, when you yeah. make that big film, get some bespoke tailor-made, custom-made. Yeah, yeah, I should. I told. I'm told that, that, that like my shoes. Told yes. Me. Okay, that's great to know. Um, bags. Uh, bags. Are you a bag girl? Here we I go. Have my favorite bag. If I speak in this, tell us about down. this. So it's handmade by a, by a girl from Portugal. Oh, watch your mic, darling. What? <laughs> watch the microphone. <gasps> Oops. No, I think that probably that definitely def did make an impact. But don't worry. I'm sorry, you guys. Okay. If it was painful no, for your ears or what fine. happened. So yeah, it's like um, it's handmade, and I really like it. It, it's, it has a lot of space, so you can put your book. It's very very resistant. Mm -hmm. And uh, then my other like elegant bag is also Nero Giardini. Because okay. I like to, when I can. Could I, you say that again slower? Nero Jardim. No, that's right. Yes, yes. I hope I don't garden. mix the. Yeah, I that's mean, the Nero Jardim. No, this no. is like this is from a girl. It's handmade oh, okay, yes. from Portugal. That one is. I like when I can to match shoes and bag, also in brand. So oh, okay. not just like Keeps yeah, when I can. Yeah, yeah, I like that. Right. Are you a neat freak or you or are you untidy? Oh my God, I'm so untidy. You're oh my messy. god. You're a messy oh, girl. The only moments I am tidy is when I'm living with someone else, but for the respect for the other. Not that I am real. Yes. I make an effort. But like real me, yes. if you really and it's bad because then you, you kinda you always lose time. <laughs> bad like, feng shui. Yeah. Are you on time? Where I am on time, yes. 
because <laughs> you have to pay. Yes, and then when it comes to like, if you go in in my my changing room, like the acting changing room is always everything like that. If you go in my house, it's a mess. Clothes is like this. Everywhere. Clothes are very well like the ones that oh. I need to wear them, like like all like iron and everything. Okay, and, and everything then else. All this kind of like jewelry, pen, everything like everywhere. Everywhere, phone. I don't know. I, I I lose my phone. I get my phone stolen. Right. I don't find my phone in my own house and this kind of thing. So you're yeah. absent-minded. You're a bit absent-minded. Ab not really absent-minded. I I mean, if it's something that I don't care about, like phone. Yeah. Uh, I am not take. I you don't forget, take care but of it. I do it. Yeah, I don't care. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Totally. Good to know. Mm -hmm. um, uh, favorite make shoes. Shoes. We did the Oxfords. I like. That's the right. Light. We did. Sorry. No. Yeah. Favorite makeup. Favorite makeup uh, mascara from um, it's this mascara from Mac. It's called Hot and no, I don't know how to pronounce like naughty. Hot and naughty. Hot and naughty. Hot and because the the cool thing about it is like you open it first time and it's like uh, light day day mascara and then if you open it with the two of them it's like more like darker mascara. So are you hot in the daytime, naughty at night, or the other Yeah, way something like that. But no, it's like what H if it's naughty in the daytime? U T or hot, hot. It's like <laughs> oh, in English. Hot, as uh, in hot couture. I don't know. I think yes, so. that's what it means. Hi. But then it's naughty in English. That's I mean I don't know. Yes. They made. A, that's why I don't know. Yes, it's sort of uptown downtown. Well, it's like this. You can yes, do exactly, it. Yes, exactly, exactly. That's why I like it. Classy and sexy at the same time. Mm. Uh, Two in one. <laughs> Favorite perfume? Now you smell oh. nice, actually. I must say, oh. you came with a perfume. Thank you. It's I have a mixture because you mix. I mix sometimes, but now I have a mixture. But sometimes I don't mix. What I have always, I cannot live without Kenzo, mm. Flower by Kenzo. It's not like I cannot live in. in this. I need to know that I have it. Flower by Kenzo, the the, the normal one, like the the first one, I have it since seven years. You can find that in your mess at home. You know where your Kenzo. Oh, that is not in the mess. Perfumes are by the clothes. Like yeah, Hanging they're up. like in their place. Good to know. Yeah, and then I have to, uh, now I have Chanel uh, Chance with flower Chance. By. Chance, yeah. It's called Chance. Yeah, right. That's the the green one. It's like that called. And then I have a, a variation of Flower by Kenzo. I don't remember which one of them because I have a lot of variations. And I just put like because I put like maybe. One and two, or like I mix, and then I also like uh, Calvin Klein Obsession, which I received as a present. And first, I hated it. I oh like, my god! I yeah. remember in my history with my wife, Calvin Klein Obsession has a special place in the most revolting smell. Revolting? What if is I smell Calvin Klein? No, maybe it's not Obsession. Maybe it's something else. It's Fahrenheit. Sorry, uh, no, sorry, no, no. There was, sorry. That was it's obsession. fucking first Fahrenheit. Do you know what Fahrenheit smells like? No. It's so horrible. I will literally get <laughs> nauseous if I smell it. Oh really? It's, Obsession's it's different. Yeah, and it's a bit intense. So first I was like, ew, it's just even a perfume. It's horrible. And then with time, I started using it, and I started liking it so much, and now I, they don't make it anymore. Is that true? Yeah. They stopped making Calvin Klein Obsession? Yeah, it's not making. But I, I have a little bit left, so I put it... It's kind of like my night... They have to bring it back. Yeah, they should. It's like my night perfume, because all the other ones are very... I like f very light, very fresh, like flower, flower back and so it's a little bit like too. Chanel is more like exactly what I like, very fresh that you can... Mm, lemony. Like you need to come lemony. like... Yeah, and you need to come like very... Like to be close to smell it and... and I like order. that. Okay, um, your favorite shop, we know that, don't we? Oh, uh, well, it's that not... That place that you got the little gold mine? No, no? that's not a favorite shop. <laughs> okay, your favorite one. shop, to buy anything, it doesn't but have to be clothes. a favorite shop, a buy... Mm, oh, anything? Anything. Decathlon. Do you know what is it? <laughs> no, I, I know, again. it's like Decathlon, it's like... Decathlon. Decathlon, yeah, I think so. It's a sportswear shop. Yeah, but there you find everything, you find also like... It's the greatest like, sportswear shop in the world? I don't know if it is in the world, but it's like one there you find everything you like. You Where is also it? wait. Uh, yeah, it's in Romania in Milano. Here, I don't know if it is. Okay, there's but, Paragon Sports here on. Yeah, it's something like big, big, big with sports. Decathlon. Yeah. Wicked. Lovely to know. Because then I like like vintage shops and secondhand shops, so I don't have a favorite favorite shop. If it's not hardcore sports. Uh, no, if it's not hardcore, yeah. <laughs> okay, favorite. Do you shop online at all? Um, sometimes I do. Um, Asus is very good because they do the um, videos as well. Okay. And you, you always you can see it. Oh, it helps so much. 
Because sometimes you see a dress in the picture, it looks okay, but then in the video you realize how it's ah. like shaping exactly. It's okay. very good to do it like with videos. Or sometimes I like it more after I see the video. That's wicked. Yeah, it's very awesome as is so, good. And then I do online shopping from Topshop because um, you don't find it the shop. So, okay. but here I know it is, but it's so expensive here. Top shop is Top supposed shop, to be affordable. Yeah, but here they make it. It's here like a dress that in in uh, London is like let's say sixty. Here's like one hundred something. Wow, yeah, that's amazing. I, like that's what they told me. I haven't been here yet, but that's what the stylist told me. So you I have to go check that out immediately. I will, cause it's like very good. Like it's really. I always find things there. Yes. What about favorite city or your place to live? As Ooh, well, to live as in opportunities, I would say New York or London, but as into a, a nice life, I would say. Why can't they be the same? The same? Why can't you have a nice life? Because I, loved Ham I love Hamburg so much Do and it's really? very nice. And it's like you have all these beautiful trees, beautiful forests in the middle, the beautiful river, beautiful buildings. That's like my favorite city. But I cannot do acting there. I okay, so English. Hamburg. So I had a German model yesterday, Elena, come, oh, yeah? and she's from Hamburg. Yeah, I she love. She loved it too. Oh, it was my on her list. Oh God, it's amazing, Hamburg. It's amazing. Great. Uh, favorite restaurant? I don't have a favorite restaurant. I like to try new tastes, but oh, as long as it's in the healthy zone. So everything that is like raw or like I try, I tried here first time Thai food I didn't like it at all it's it too it's strong? too strong yeah I really like very light ones I love the you know quinoa and avocado blah 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 quinoa uh, yes yeah, sort of quinoa. modern healthy food yeah so exactly. what would your favorite meal be then well um if you could I only eat one oh, I don't know something one thing. that's healthy if I could eat one thing and I would have to it would be like something related to salads a lot of salads but just one thing it would be yogurt yogurt okay yeah, yogurt. good you could survive on yogurt if you had yes, to. Yes, yes. Well, it has everything, doesn't it? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's a bit very good. mucus forming. Always, what? Because it's dairy. Yeah, probably. yeah. I mean, you cannot leave just in yogurt. But, yes, but you probably could, you know. No, I think it was good. It's got acidoph so acidophilus, good for your microbiome. Yeah, but is that good? Like, yeah, I don't know. I'm good with that. I think yogurt and at least some I'm almonds. I'm sure it's really good for you. Yog I'm sure yogurt and almonds can keep you alive for yeah. a very almonds long time. Can. Yeah. yeah. Okay, um, holiday destination. Well, I like to go to new places all the time, so I don't know. What's have your favorite, favorite so far? Where have you been on a holiday? Ever? Ever. Visited that you would love it so much that you go back for more? Well, actually, it's in my country. It's in, Romania? It's, uh, yeah, it's, it's Brasov, it's called. It's a city. I like it so much. It's very. There is this uh, the black church, and I, I don't know exactly why that's the place where I feel very relaxed, like very relaxed. Like I would go there before a big exam, I, alone even. I would go there before like to relax. I would go there to ex escape like two days from everything that's going on. That's yeah. fantastic. So that's like one of What's... the places that I was there. Yeah, and it's like more like in the mountains. Can I you really spell like it? Brush, uh, B, R, A. Special Romanian S, but let's just put S, uh -huh. O, and V. What's the Romanian dish? The Romanian dish. The Romanian dish? The national dish. What do Romanians eat? <sighs> it's very famously. difficult because everything while we eat and we say it's ours, it's kind of like, I would say that is not, like the Romanian dish is like, let's say some meat rolls, um, meat and, and, um, and rice, and over that a leaf of... Um, Oh, great. Vinely. Yeah, yeah, great. yeah, yeah, but it's not really ours, but we say sarmale. And then uh. we say polenta, it's ours, but it's not really ours. And then, blood. I mean, blood, it, yes, exactly, the blood, blood people. No, I think just the real typical one could be the, the meat rolls. We have like those meat, meat rolls like that and we call them... No, actually, a friend of mine that is Czech told me that they have it. Uh, what's I don't it know, it's just like, it's just the typical, maybe hmm. typical sweets. We have like some typical sweets. Such as? It's called Poilembrou, but I don't know exactly. I, I didn't wow. eat so much, so I don't know how to explain it. <laughs> now, a lot of movies around the world shoot in Romania because of the unspoilt, untouched, virgin countryside. Yeah, it is. There, because it's it's, so there aren't that too many elements of modern yeah, life. Yeah, and there, is like, there are so many beautiful places in Romania, so many beautiful churches and everything. It's, and I haven't seen it yet all. So... I would um, like to have some time to visit also there. Uh, it's your country. And exercise? Uh, roll, running. Uh, yeah, races, 800 meters still. Yeah, I mean, no, I run, no, I run long. I run like 40 minutes in the morning, but it's easy run. It's not like I 
kill myself and I think about so many things I'm crazy like I put for example as I'm watching Peaking Blinders mm -hmm. while I'm running I listen to music and I imagine like uh, episodes with me I create my own character and I epi episodes with me I'm like doing like let's say meditation daydreaming while I'm running and I'm thinking like what would I do what would happen I create scenarios and everything that's fantastic uh, so it will visualization be yes it will be running but then I do everything in the gym I'm um, not weights but I do like all these cardio things pilates yoga yes. but favorite all time running running running, running. wicked and then the last one uh, animal pet <laughs> Um, animal pet uh, would be, I don't know, I had a parrot, so I would say parrot. Wicked! What's yeah. his name? It was, I had, it was Ricky, and he was the tiny, tiny green one, and he was very energetic and crazy. Oh. But every time he would put his hand e here, he would jump. So I put like this and jump, and like oh, this right. jump and put him here, he was like, he was. I don't know why. The, He's an ex-parrot? Uh, yeah, he, he was. has ceased ceased he, to be. He yes, but he he I he was with us twelve years or something That's a long like time. that. Like long time for a little parrot because super they intelligent. usually live like a lot. Not they super, do. but like they the most intelligent parrot is the green grey yes, one. Yes, that's right. Yeah, actually I did some African research gray? on parrots. Yeah, Why? with the red know. tail. Love those. Yeah. And then last one, your social media platform of choice. Wow, platform of choice. Yeah. Uh, so YouTube for all that information and music? What do you, what do you mean? Yeah, social media. What, like favorites? Uh, Twitter. I, I'm Snapchat. bad with that. I'm going to start. Like, just wait. I'm okay, going to get so many yet. followers. Instagram. But I'm like, I would be Instagram. No, what I use, it's not social media. Is it Pinterest? Is it called? No, it's, yeah. It's kind of like social media. Totally. That is, for me, what I use all the time. That's where I create my boards, secret boards. Perfect. We want to know what these boards are. The dream the, boards that will, 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 will oh, watch not just your the life. Dream boards. Uh, no, I create um, dream boards. Not so much. I create the boards with positions because you find like positions and like editorials. So I put there like models that I like and the position and that editorial and this old like vintage and Fantastic. like Versace and everything that are always hidden. So. Amazing. <laughs> Thank you. I love that secret life of Diana. We'll watch the movie one day. <laughs> Thank yeah. you so much for coming. Thank you for having me. I had great. so much fun. Thank it was so brilliant. It, I enjoyed it so much as well. Thank you so much. Bye, Bye. everyone. Bye. We'll see you again soon. No.